Hey, it's Clary, and today I'll be showing you how to upload a custom world on your Bedrock server. Before we start, this method only works with official Bedrock dedicated servers. It won't work with Pocket Mine or similar programs because they use different world formats. Firstly, find your Bedrock world by pressing the Windows key and searching for percentage local app data percentage. Open the packages folder, then navigate to Microsoft.Minecraft. It'll be a little bit tricky to find, but you'll be able to see it here. Then you'll be able to open up local state, games, and follow the steps on the screen until you see Minecraft worlds. Here you'll see a bunch of folders with random names. These are your worlds. Open up a couple to see if the files inside look similar to what's on the screen right now. If you're not sure which folder is your world, open up the level name.txt document inside each folder. It reveals the actual name of the world. Now let's upload the world to our server. Make sure you're still in the Minecraft Worlds folder. Click on the address bar at the top and copy the entire path. We'll need this for later. Really quickly, I'm also going to be showing you what my world looks like so then you can see that it's the same once I've uploaded it onto the server. Head over to your server's control panel and then make sure it's turned off. Then navigate to the file section of your service and then worlds. This is where you'll upload your world. Click the upload button and choose upload folder. Paste the copied path from your world folder location into the address bar. Select the specific world you want to upload and click upload. Finally, click upload once again to complete the upload. Now, there's one final step. We need to tell the server which world to run. Notice how the uploaded world folder has a strange name. Let's rename it for easier management. Select the folder and click rename. Avoid using special characters in the new name. While renaming, copy the new name as we'll need it later. Head back to your server's file directory and open the server.properties file. Find the line level name and replace it with the new name you just gave your world folder. Finally, save the file and start your server. Wait for it to fully boot up and once it's online, copy the host name. Open up Minecraft Bedrock and then enter the appropriate details to join your server. Then connect. You should then see your single player world loaded. And there it is. It's the exact same world as before. Now you can play with your friends in your own custom world. I hope I was able to assist you in setting up your server. If you have any further questions, please leave a comment down below or contact our support. Bye guys.